Koya, welcome to the live stream. Is that gonna work? It's a bit wonky. Better straighten up uh, this way. Is that better? Uh, that'll do. Put it on the mirror mode, my people. Mirror mode, this one. This one, the mirror mode. Welcome everybody. Let me just uh, do some final setting up. And I'll double check, um, double check that everything is good on YouTube. Let me go and check to see how the live stream looks on YouTube. Da, 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 da. What's going on? How are ya? Let me just double check that the live stream on YouTube is all good. And then we shall get on with it. Good morning, I am done. <laughs> oh, I like the name. I'm over this. I'm done, man. <laughs> okay, fried rice today, peeps. Let me just double check everything is good for the live stream on YouTube. Haven't been on YouTube for about a month, I reckon. Took me a couple hours to set up. Good morning, JS Stevens. What is up? Oh, by the way, how's the audio? I've put a new mic in, an external mic onto my phone. Is the audio like really um, weird or bad? I'm gonna have to readjust that. Okay, the phone has started. Oh no, it's turning off again. I think, um, because they're all flat. Be right back. No, these ones aren't going to work either. These ones are all broken. What if I plug it in? That might help. Okay. Hang on, let's check it on this one. There's no... There's no headphone thing on this one. Oh my goodness. Hello, Rome's. What's going on? Let me just check. Is there a headphone thing on this one? Maybe this one. Okay, maybe this one will work. Uh, okay, let's try this. Do, 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 do. Weird stuff going on here. Okay, so we're gonna go to YouTube. Where's YouTube? Why are you just checking the streams? Okay, now go here. Go here. Okay, let's see what's going on. Let's see if this works. that. Okay, let's do an audio test for YouTube. See if everything's in sync. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I think that's good. Hello. Hello, uh, Kuchi. Kuchi man, what's going on? What's going on, bro? Audio is terrible, isn't it? Oh my goodness, is that better? That audio is terrible. Let 
No, I don't really remember you, Kuchi. Is the audio still really bad now? Or is it just me? How's the live, by the way? Is it really weird? that. Okay, maybe I'm gonna have to um, restart that because I had an external mic and I was testing it. Okay, see you guys later. I'm gonna stop and then restart. Kuchi man, is that audio a bit better? That was kind of weird. I was testing and... Um, how long ago was that, Kuchi? I don't... I feel bad that I don't remember you, but... Oh, thank goodness. Um, I kind of feel bad that I can't remember you, but... Um... Doot, 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 doot. Okay, let's, uh... See if I can. Sorry about this one. I just gotta set this up. Okay. There we go. Two months or three months. Oh, I feel bad, Kuchi. <laughs> so much has happened, though. Um, I don't have that many viewers. So I mean, I should be able to remember you. Was it Jack Dub? No, I don't remember that name. Okay, audio is so much better. There we go. So happy now. Oh, that was scary. Sorry, dude. I can't remember. <laughs> you haven't, if you haven't been on recently, it's your fault. <laughs> Joking, man. Oh, thanks for joining anyway. So long time no see, huh? <laughs> alright, had some technical issues there. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Let's get started, bro. So, if, 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 it was, if you haven't been watching for a while, then obviously my live streams aren't good enough, Kuchi. So I'm going to have to um, up the ante, eh? <laughs> Give me some ideas, make it, make everything fresh and new. And new. Hello, Ryan Kennedy. How are ya? Okay. Got to wear gloves today because I've got cuts and burns all over my fingers. Because I'm back at work. Uh, back chefing in the kitchen. Hello, Mary. Mary Yako, what's going on? Oh, yeah. So don't use an external mic on TikTok. At least not on this phone in the way I just did it because that didn't really work. That didn't really work at all. So first things first, let me get this annoying bloody hair out of my face. Sorry guys. <laughs> I thought it'd be cool if there, some of it was a bit loose, but now it's just really annoying. So don't do that. If you're cooking, you don't want your hair in your face. This is a bit embarrassing actually. Displaying my vanity on live stream. Sorry guys. <laughs> oh yeah. Hello, Hussam. What's up? Okay, let's get let's get to the good stuff. Let's start cooking. I've got a heap of ingredients. Just gonna do a super super. Um, I guess you could say a little bit of a lazy uh, fried rice. 
Okie dokie. Do do Hello Wayne. What's going on? Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. So this music is a bit trippy, but uh it's uh this is a uh, royalty free music on Spotify, just some random, but I'm not really liking it at all. First things first, we've got some chicken, which we are going to chop up a little bit. It's defrosting, so it's a bit runny. But uh, So I'm going to do fried rice, but I'm going to pre-cook the, the meats, which is the lovely chicken that I have here. Oh, this music is so annoying. I've got to change it, guys. Hey Google, play royalty free music. Sorry, I didn't understand. Doesn't understand, okay. Hey Google, play uplifting royalty free music on Spotify. Play the album uplifting pop instrumental royalty free music on Spotify. There we go, let's hope this is a little bit better. Uh, I've heard this one a few times, but it's gonna have to do. Okay, dice up the chicken, easy peasy. Do do do. Easy peasy. If you want a better view, by the way, guys, I'm on YouTube. You'll get, you'll get a, you'll get a way better view on YouTube. Okay, dice up the chicken. Do. do. Fit in here nicely. And we'll just marinate it a little bit with uh, the soy sauce. Sort of a bit defrosted it, I had it frozen, so it's just a little bit of juice here, a little bit of chicken juice, raw chicken juice. We don't want that hanging around. Hello, lost in the bush, what's up? Hello Grizzly Michelle. Why so grizzly? Welcome to the live stream. We're cooking a fried rice. Do you like fried rice? Do 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 Okay, just dice up this chicken. Chuck in a little bit of soy sauce, a little bit of barbecue, a little bit of seasoning. Cook that off. Actually, I probably should be doing this a little bit smaller. Because I probably don't want big chunks in the fried rice. I might turn that music down a little bit. Hey Google, set volume 40%. It's a little bit better. There we go. Hello, Summer Dreams. What is up? <coughs> Maybe I should check out who's Coochie. Hello, Mel Baba. Are you from Melbourne? What's going on, Mel Baba? I'm from Melbourne too. Do, 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 oh, Nate Smith, sorry I just saw your comment. Hey, what's up? <laughs> I'm not used to YouTube anymore. I haven't been on YouTube for like a month now, Nate. So, um, if you're still there, what's up? <laughs> Hello, yes, I'm from Vic. I'm from, oh, Gippsland. I'm a fellow Gippslander as well, but I'm in, in Melbourne now. <laughs> Green, green Gippsland. <laughs> to be honest, I... Uh, I don't miss it. <laughs> but... It's the green, green farmlands. Hello, Sugar Plum. Coochie. What's going on, Coochie? 
do 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 Could she, if you're one of the old time followers, used to follow me way back, what have I been cooking? <laughs> Tell me what I've been cooking. What was my favorite, your favorite show? Hello, Black. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Thanks for the like, Ez John. Was it Black3066? You said to come on to YouTube. Ah, oh, thanks for. <laughs> so, Queensland. I, I wish I was in Queensland. Well, actually, no. What's the weather like up there? It's. It's Melbourne can't make up its mind. It's summer, winter, summer, winter. Pasta and mince with there we go. Yeah, that's one of the old ones. You're okay, Gucci. Yep. Yeah. That's one of the oldies. Was the pasta? Was it mince? Did I put mince? It sounds like me just chucking some random mince in a soup. That's what you were cooking with some but yeah, that sounds right. <laughs> okay, Gucci. I, I totally believe you now, and I and I apologize for not remembering you. But since then, I did a lot, a lot of live streaming, and what else? But I haven't been live streaming much lately, because uh, hopefully I'll get back into a rhythm. <laughs> Coochie, <laughs> gorgeous. The weather's gorgeous in Queensland. So jealous, so jealous right now. I'll get a couple of days off. Spend the first day recovering. It's beautiful and sunny. As soon as I feel like doing stuff, pff, starts raining. Love Melbourne weather. Absolutely love it. Okay, so we've got... I'm making fried rice, by the way, guys. So I've just diced up a little bit of chicken. I'll chuck in some marinade. I've got some... What have we got? A little bit of... This is, I think, Filipino barbecue. Just a little bit of marinade. A little bit of that. I live in... Oh, you live in Brizzy too, Kuchi? You guys making me jealous, far out. <laughs> but I must admit, it's going to get really, really hot soon, nah? Like, it's going to get really humid and... Because it's the wet season now, no? So I probably won't miss that. Okay, we've got a little bit of soy, a little bit of barbecue. Chuck in a little bit of oil. Um, I'll just put the oil in the pan, keep it simple. Oh, yeah. Do, do, do. Hello, Jace96. Okay. So I've got like, I've got spinach, I've got ham. Is that going to focus on? So I've got band aids. I've been, been back at work and I've got all these cuts and burns, so I'll be wearing gloves today. I've got eggs, rice, carrots. I'm just going to prepare, do all my miss and plus. Uh, is that how you say it? All my preparation. I'm gonna mix it all into one big bowl, and I'm gonna fry it in small batches so I get it nice and crispy, like as fried rice should be. Um, except uh, the only difference is I don't have sticky rice because I don't really know how to make that. Uh, but I've got yesterday's rice. What is the? Uh, this is just canola oil. <laughs> Just canola oil, veggie oil, something with a high, high burnt, high burning temperature. Okay, he's gonna get really noisy. That's not too bad. Put my gloves on. Send some fried rice to me. <laughs> Too far away, Kuchi. <laughs> Hang on, it's gonna take me finger up. So yeah, I've been Melbourne's been locked down for what six, for like six months. So I've just gone back to work. I'm a chef by trade, and I'm burning myself and cutting myself. It always happens. It's, it's like starting a new job. Just so nervous. Um, I mean, it happens anyway, but even though I, I know everyone at work, because I was 
I've gone back to my old work, but um, a few things have changed and I'm a little bit out of practice, so. Okay, fry this off. Might chuck a little bit of seasoning in there. Hello, yeah baby, hello Igor, what's going on? Dude, so let's put a glove on, cover up my handies. Uh, what seasoning? I might chuck a little bit of, uh, a little bit of pasta in there, shall we? Got some chicken powder. Chuck a little bit of that in. Chicken, uh, bouillon. Is it bouillon powder? A little bit of that. There we go. A little bit of pepper. There we go. Oh, the gloves not fitting on properly now. You cook some good meals to be honest. Thanks, Coochie. Um, it's just the family meals, you know? Like, I hope now that I'm back at work, if I can get back into a rhythm, maybe live stream once a week. I get inspired by all the other chefs at work and the food we're cooking. So hopefully I'll do some, um, like cafe food, rather than just the, the home cooking. Super lazy home cooking. What's cooking mate? Yeah baby, we're cooking uh, fried rice bro. Me, me a lemon, hello me a lemon. There you go, can I get this glove on? It's a bit surgical, doesn't it? So right now I'm just cooking, uh, cooking out the meat. So pre-cooking the chicken. It's a little bit chunky, but that's all right. We've got some ham, diced ham. I'll, I've got some spinach, which I'll, I'll chiffonade that into like, just so that will add some color. I will julienne the carrots. I've got a few carrots. I've got some onion. So I'm, do, I'm doing it all from scratch today. Nothing wrong with what you were doing. Thanks, mate. I appreciate that. <laughs> So this chicken, I just chucked in a little bit of a, uh, this is a Philippine, Filipino barbecue marinade, I believe. A little bit of soy, just to... So the way I cook fried rice at home is I just make sure everything's either pre-cooked, except the veggies, that's okay. Also got eggs, by the way. Um, I'm just gonna chuck it all into a big bowl. Even, even the rice, I got the rice. I'm going to mix it all together. I'm going to put a, a little bit of oil in there. I'm going to put salt, pepper, and stock powder, and garlic. Mix it all up. And then I'm going to fry it in small batches so I get a, a nice hot wok, really crispy. Um, so I get that nice fried rice texture. I mean, like, so if you're buying fried rice at a restaurant, in one wok, they're, they're just doing like, at least, you know, probably just one serve. So really high temperature, you're getting that nice, um, you know, that nice fried flavor. So it's not like a, an Indian rice dish, which is, um, which is not so much fried, but rather just, you know, it's all about the spices rather than the, uh, the texture. And I think this chicken's good. So I'll take her off. Hey, let's move on to uh, let's move on to the uh, the rest of the prep. Okie dokie. Okie dokie is a little bit hot. Should be right. Ooh, a little bit hot. There you go. So what's next? Uh, what should I prep next? The onion. Let's do the carrots, shall we? Carrots or onions? Let's go onions. Do, do, do. What knife can I do? This one should do the trick. Saltantic. Saltantic. Hello, what's up? Oh, these onions are going. So, it's Julianne. Julianne the onion. Julianne the carrot. Julianne the spinach. I just, see, I'm just using spinach, you know, like, how much money do you make an hour? Um, 
on a weekday, standard, I think it's only like 22 bucks. I'm just employed as a commie chef, like, cause I'm new at the current workplace. But to be honest, that's not, yeah, pay as a chef is not, for me at least, has not always been that good, but I'm not, I move around a lot, so I'm not fussy. I don't ask for a lot of money. Like if you're um, gonna, run, I've run, I've run like four kitchens, but I've never asked for a lot of money because like, uh, but anyway, but that being said, on a week, if I'm, I'm getting paid properly at this place. I'm actually getting overtime for the first time in my life. So if I'm doing over 40, 45 hours or something, all the hours after that, it's something like 45 bucks an hour. So it was just really crazy. But, um, kangaroo, you're back. How's the audio now, mate? But, uh, yeah, I know, man. But that being said, um, on the weekends, it's something like 30 something bucks. And then on Sunday, it's like 40 or 50 bucks or something like that. Look, so I'm, I'm taking, I'm happy with what I'm taking home. Like, but just as the, as the flat rate, the, it's only like 22 bucks. And I know that sucks, but, uh, it is, uh, <laughs> I might go there. Thanks for the likes, Coochie. Did I push something there? Do, 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 do. Um, okay, onions. But yeah, I'm getting a lot of penalty rates, so I'm pretty, pretty happy. But yeah, I think I'm on such a low rate because I'm just as a commie chef. Because uh, I'm working at a, it's a busy cafe, it's St. Ali in South Melbourne. They have like at least five other chefs, maybe more. So I'm just like the new guy. I'm on, I'm, I'm on the lowest wage. So, uh, but I'm getting all the penalty rates uh, for overtime and on the weekends. So it's an, an overtime, which is really good. So I'm taking home as much as, as much as I have when I've been a head chef at the end of the, uh, almost, almost at the end of the day, not too bad. Because, uh, you know, if I was a head chef, I'd just be on a flat flat rate. Doesn't matter how many hours I do, doesn't matter, I just get... So, it's working, it's kind of, kind of coming out even. That being said, though, I've never been head chef at a big place. Uh, the most I think I've ever been on was... I think it was like 65,000, which is still isn't that great. But it, I'm happy with that for now. Like, I'm not after... If you want if you want a chef job that gives you eighty, a hundred thousand dollars a year... You're working like 80 hour weeks, you have no life, you have no family. So yeah, being a chef, uh, it's not about the money, I guess, but um, unless you're smart. If you work smart, it's all good. We have all got to start somewhere, bro. Yeah, that's it, bro. I mean, I have been cooking for 15 years, but <laughs> So the dream is, the dream, oh, here we go, here's Miko. The dream is to do what Miko's doing. He's got his own bistro now. How long have you been cooking, Mick? 20, 30 years? And uh, how much are you turning over a week at the moment? Is it 10 grand and you're happy with that? Miko's gonna join the live and... Oh, by the way, Miko, strictly G-rated today, Miko. Strictly G-rated. I'm on YouTube. <coughs> so that's the plan. To uh, do what Miko's doing in another 10 years. Have my own gig. No life to do. <laughs> oh, by the way, everyone, if you want to send uh, a Melbourne chef some love, uh, check out Greedy Bear Bistro. That's, uh, that is Mick Defoe's Bistro. There you go. You can go now, Mick. Gave you a shout out. <laughs> What's today? Friday. Mick, you'll be busy soon. Are you at work yet? Hello, Malbaba. Welcome back again. Friday, it's gonna be. Are you working today, Mick? It's gonna be a busy night, yeah? NVY Jake, what's going on? Oh, NV Jake. Is that NV? Okay, onion done. Let's move on to the carrots. 
cooking a lazy fried rice. Sorry I had a phone call. <laughs> All good, Bubba. You, you're free. Have the power. You've got the power to be free. <laughs> you don't have to watch me. <laughs> is that gonna? Is that gonna work? Okay, let's peel some. Uh, peel some carrots. Do. What's going on, Miko? You still there? It's a busy man, Miko. Do 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 do. Nothing. Do, do. Hectic Gronk. Hello. Super organized. Super easy. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's <laughs> so. What? So how is it, Mick? How long have you been doing greedy bear for now? Is it two years? So you've had. Is it two or three years? So you've had like, you know, you had a few hard years there, like with uh, ups and downs, a little bit of trial and error. You've got your system figured out and you finally found a new gig. So hard work pays off, yeah? I know you're trying to make it look like it's all easy. It's all been easy, but <laughs> I'm sure it, it's <laughs> Mickey two steps. But yeah, you've been through a few hard yards, yeah, Mick? <laughs> Corona, Corona, Vic, Vic, land of the milk. <laughs> yeah, Mick, don't get too comfortable. <laughs> oh, you're smart, Alec. <laughs> uh, you're smart, Alec, you are. <laughs> there we go. Oh, dear. Uh. <laughs> All right, we'll just julienne some of these carrots. I got me trusty julienne machine. This is called a mandolin. <laughs> uh, smart Alec Miko, always. <laughs> Of milk and honey. Well, Mick, you know what happens every time you say that? Stuff happens. So, God bless you and God speed. God speed you in all your enterprises, Mick. <laughs> Alright. Let's see how this goes. Do, do, do. Just Julianne. Get in that skateboard and come visit. Get. <laughs> when when was the last time I visited you? Uh, you're gonna have to wait another Mick now, Mick. What do you cook? Ah, uh, Kangaroo Steve, uh, fried rice, bro. <clears throat> you're gonna have to wait another week, Mick, because this is this is me day off. I'll be going to bed soon. Oh, hang on, I've got a, a bit of a late start tomorrow. Hello, Nick's Tick. So I'm just doing all the prep right now, Steve. I'm julienning. I cooked off some meats. Julienne the uh, onion. Julienne the carrot. I'll chiffon out a little bit of spinach just for colour. Obviously, you don't put spinach in fried rice, but if you dice it up, you know, cut it up a little bit, just gives it a bit of colour. No one's going to know. I'll be going away next. Oh my goodness, what? You're that comfortable at work, Mick? <laughs> or are you closing for Christmas? <laughs> oh, I always feel like you're bragging, Mick. <laughs> uh, where are you going, Mikko? Have the... Closing. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you going? Oh, I've got the yawns now. Oh. Yarra. I was going to ask, is it Yarrawonga? You're going to get. You'll be on the. 
I haven't been there since I was a kid. We, I think we hollered, my family holidayed there a couple of times. Hello, Courtney. Oh, I've got the yawns now. What's going on? Need some caffeine. <laughs> Excuse me, <laughs> why am I yawning? Too comfortable. Okay, there's the carrots, folks. Alrighty, doing all our prep. A little bit of carrot. Way too comfortable and casual today. This is how it should be, folks. Just chilling at home. Doing the prep, feeding the family. Okay, now it's a... Uh, now we've got spinach, yeah? So I'm just gonna... It's called chiffonade. Just gonna slice it up kind of thin, kind of thinly, and I'll chuck that in the fried rice right at the end, just to give it a bit of colour, make it look a uh, bit more prettier. Oh, I'm still yawning. What's going on, Mick? Whiskey Creek. What's going on? Okay, so kind of just uh, scrunch it up, kind of roll it a little bit, and then. There you go, that's kind of a rough chiffonade. Not very fine, but it's good enough. Do do. We should get a box of munchies each and have live race slicing. Oh my goodness, Mick. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna play on your terms. <laughs> You'll kick me, mate. <laughs> you've chosen a, you've chosen a, you've chosen knife skills specifically because you're way better than me, mate. <laughs> Have a, <laughs> I don't know how I can, uh, I don't know how I can make this, uh, hello wildcat. I don't know how it can be a fair competition. I don't think I even want to say one on your terms, one on my terms. I don't think I even want that. Yeah, it'd be fun for you. It'd be embarrassing for me. <laughs> well, how about put it more in your favour? We do something like um, an avocado flower competition. <laughs> I'll cheat, mate. I'll prepare one in advance and I'll do a sleight of hand and then present it. Oh, what do you reckon? Uh... <laughs> You, no, I don't want to compete, mate. Not, it's not, not right now. <laughs> Hello, Corky. <laughs> Just, how, Mick, how about we you go live cooking for your family? Do you ever cook for your family, Mick? That'll be a good competition. It'll make your wife happy too. <laughs> Hello user GGTV39UF2, what's up? <coughs> Bubbles, what's going on? Bubbles, I'm on YouTube too, if you want the good view. <laughs> or if you want the chat, stay on TikTok. Depends what your priority is. I got the yawns, what's going on? <laughs> Excuse me, people. What's the time now? The time is 1.34. As they say, happy wife, that's it. That's it, kangaroo. I'm trying to help you out, Mick. <laughs> happy wife, happy life. Kangaroo, have you been out yet? Have you been out bush? Oh, I'm still yawning. This is embarrassing. I don't think I've ever been yawning on my live streams ever. Have I got a coffee going? I've got a coffee from a couple of hours ago. This will do me. But you know what, on live normally I don't do all the prep. I usually do all the prep off camera and then when I'm on camera I just go get stuff done. Hello Pilgrim family. Hello Bubbles. What's going on? How's the, how's the quality there? Is it, it's not even focused on my face. Is it? I've been swapping me cameras Cameras around a little bit for YouTube. I had some troubleshooting as well. 
Hello Princess92. But I think it's good enough YouTube, yeah? Is it good enough? It's got a, a new lens happening. Hello Greenie. That's good. That's good. If Bubbles is happy, I'm happy. So what are you up to at the moment, Mick? Oh my goodness, I'm still yawning. It's so embarrassing, guys. I apologize. This is the prep part. This is the boring part. We'll start cooking in a minute. Wern Koo, how are ya? Du was so at nine and nine. And this is the best royalty free music I could find. Oh, hang on. Got a little bit of, it's this bit of rock or something. Maybe that'll wake me up. Okay, I think that's, uh... Okay, so we got, let's show it to the camera. We got carrot, we got spinach. Uh, by the way, guys, if you want to see, go on YouTube, because I've got an aerial camera on YouTube as well. So, uh, we've got ham, we've got, oh, rice, we've got eggs. Um, onion, garlic. There we go. Onion, garlic. Got the chicken I cooked. Oh, good stuff, kangaroo. Sounds good. And what am I missing? I've got to crack up. I've got to scramble all the eggs right now. We were leaving for New South Wales. Now have COVID case back. So, oh goodness, far out. Okay, so let's um, let's do all the eggs. Excuse me. Crack up, crack all the eggs now into a little uh, little bowl and um, whisk them up a bit, and we'll be ready to rock and roll. Get this fried rice happening. There we go. Do, 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 do. So where are you heading, uh, Steve-o? Where are you going to go if you can't go to New South Wales? You too, Mick. <laughs> See you on the flip side, Sheffy. <laughs> Stephen Blair, welcome. Do, 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 do. Do, lots of eggs. The family like like a lot of eggs in there, fried rice. It's a bit, couple of bits of shell in there. Do. Okay, fun bit's gonna start soonishy. I think this is the last thing I've got to prep is this egg. Oi. And then we will start the cooking. <laughs> Far out. <laughs> you just wing it. You just gotta wing it, Steve O. Oh Val Val welcome Valerie! <laughs> Careful guys, the moderator's in the house. <laughs> What's going on Val? I'm on, I'm, on, I'm on YouTube now too Val. But I know you're here for, for the friendly chat, so don't feel pressured to go on YouTube. Remember Val, you've got the power to do whatever you want. <laughs> Alright, that'll do. This bowl's full, so that's almost two dozen eggs. I'll just uh, chuck these little leggies in the fridge. Whisk these bad boys up. I am so tired. I haven't been to bed since yesterday morning. Did all my big bomb order. Sounds good. People coming up. Ah, good stuff, Val. Smashed it, mate. <laughs> good work. <laughs> Ha 
how many eggs? Uh, just one in each, one in each hand, Steve. <laughs> Can you do two? Can you do like two in each, like four eggs? That'd be... I've never tried more than that though. Is that, is that a thing? I'll have to look it up on YouTube. Hello Christmas special. Good stuff, Val. Got it all over and done with, yeah? Hello Empress, what's going on? There we go, oh, a little bit. How's that looking? Is that mixed up enough? Dude. There we go, I think that should do it. Okay, let's get on to the cooking, my people. Let's start the cooking, finally. <coughs> how, do I, how, how do I do it? <coughs> and now, for the, <laughs> for the moment you've all been waiting for, <laughs> let's make some fried rice. Being boring, what you making? Fried rice, Empress. We're making a fried rice. So what have I done? I've just done all my prep and now I'm just going to mix it all into a big bowl. Uh, this is the uh, this is the, the cheats lazy way. So we've got our rice. We're going to mix it all in, put all the seasoning in there and then we're going to fry it in small batches though so we get our nice crispy, nice and crispy. So this rice is a little bit sticky which is um, that's okay. Maybe I can, um, because I use like sticky rice at the, uh, at the restaurants, yeah? Whoa. It's sticking all to my fingers. A little bit more rice. <coughs> do, do, how much rice do we want? I haven't done much cooking for the fam lately, so I'll do a big batch. There we go. See how that goes. Do Rice sticking everywhere. Okay, we've got our carrot. We've got our onion. We got diced ham. Do do we got the chicken I just cooked, which I chucked in a little bit of soy sauce and um, barbecue marinade. <coughs> we got, what else have we got? Uh, garlic. Put in the garlic, just some of this chicken. Sorry, someone. <laughs> Go get the doorbell. <laughs> Don't keep them waiting. <laughs> Business is business, fell. <laughs> I know you're doing it for cher oh, heaps of garlic. There we go. It's gonna be yum, yum oh. What's next? Uh, okay, let's put in some of our seasoning. Got our chicken. Uh, I think it's chicken bouillon powder. It's basically just MSG, yeah. So I won't put too much of this, but enough to make it. You want that yummy, that kind of like Moorish. You want people to just, oh, oh, it's quite a little bit actually. You want people to be, oh, just a little bit more, just a little bit more. <laughs> that means they're happy with it. Okay, a fair little bit of pepper. Don't want it too spicy, there we go. And a little bit of salt because um, MSG is salty, but it's not the same thing, yeah? And I still got a lot of egg to put in, so. I can probably there we go. See how see how that goes. And a little bit of oil. How much there we go. See how that goes. I'll mix all that up. And we're ready to rock and roll. 
do 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 okay mix all these mix it all up pretty big batch so I reckon that seasoning should should be pretty okay so this is the cheats lazy way cheats just mix it all up and then fry it off in small batches and for each batch I will add a little bit of egg hello Jalil a little bit of egg and a little bit of green stuff which is gonna be delicious do 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 Oh yeah. Do 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 do. Oh, look at all that. It smells delicious. It's a little bit gooey right now, but once we fry this up, it's going to be spot on. Well, good enough for the family, anyway. I'm going to make sure I broke all that rice up. Oh, it smells great. Okay, let me take a change of gloves. Let's get ready to rock and roll, people. Okay, so now, start cooking. Start cooking in small batches. Try and get this wok up really hot. Super hot wok. That's what we want. Do, 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 do. Do 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 Oh, nice hot walk. There we go. <laughs> Hello, butterfly. Steve, the reason why I, the only reason why I can do that is because you know what, guys? I might just take a little break, actually, before I start cooking. <laughs> Should I take a little break? Oh, no, nah, I'll just, just have some coke, Mark. You'll be right. I'll just have a drink. Um, so what was it? I think it was 12 months ago now, or six months ago. I was in Western Australia for six months. So I was working, did some casual work for... Um, For who did I do it for? For the mines, for the so you you're feeding like a couple of thousand people. And at one of the places, I had to do like a thousand eggs every morning for breakfast, and that's where I learned how to do the double egg thing. But I couldn't do it for for even though I'm a chef, I just couldn't do it like because I never really tried, never really had to do that many eggs. There we go. Let's get this happening. Actually, guys, I'm going to take a little break. So while this pan's preheating, just let me write a little note, though. I'll, I'll write a little note. Be back in... I'll just write a little note for the camera. Say, be back in two minutes. How's that? <laughs> Turn that off. Do hello Zoo Shack. Um, just 
just trying to work out how to do this without because I've just had that really hot so I'll do that I think if I put this here that should be fine be back in two minutes there we go is that good just gonna take a little break be right back excuse me Be back in two minutes, guys. Two minutes. Do, do. 
Hey, what's up, Enforcer of Mayhem Pack Up? <laughs> Hello, Soup Dumpling. Welcome back. Do do. Okay, let's get started. Let's let's start the start the cooking. Okay, preheat this wok. Nice and nice and hot. Do 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 do. This music is so annoying. Let's see if I can change the tunes. Hey Google, play royalty-free music on YouTube. Sorry, I don't understand. Doesn't understand. <coughs> hey Google, play royalty-free music. Sorry, I didn't understand. Hey Google, play royalty-free music on Spotify. Let's see if it knows. The album, there we go. Okie dokie, let's start the cooking. Oh, the cat's getting restless. I want to come in now. Gonna have to wait because we got cooking to do. Okay. This is what we did all the prep for. We did all the prep so that we can Chuck it all in nice and easy and cook Kuchi Man's back. Okay, so now for the cooking people. Let's start the cooking. Okay, get this wok really hot. So this is what we got. We've got our fried rice, right? We chucked everything in there. The rice, ham, chicken, carrot, garlic, seasoning, a little bit of oil. Fry it off in small batches, get it nice and crispy. That's how we like it. So it's really fried rice. It's not boiled rice. Oh, get this wok super hot, a little bit hotter. Smoke it. Smoking. Do, do, do. Smoking now, almost ready. A couple of little bits of rice in there that are popping off. Do, 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 do. If you want a better view, guys, by the way, go to YouTube and you can see, um, you can see in there. Do, 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 do. Have you got two accounts, Mayhem? Okay. Let's go. There we go. That's what we want. Nice and hot. A little bit more. Let's see if we can get the desired texture. There we go. Delicious. The suet nine and nine. Ya da 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 da. Da 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 da. Ya da 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 da. Okay, now we just let it cook. Easy peasy. <laughs> and I'll chuck in the egg mix, which oh, you can't, it's going to tip if I, you can see that on YouTube. <laughs> Once that's cooked out, I'll make a little well in the middle like that. And I will put the egg in and then just a little bit of spinach. And that's batch number one. I reckon I've got like eight batches at least today. So it's all about the texture, all about getting it crispy so that the family's like, oh, did you buy this fried rice? Because it tastes so good. <laughs> Not really, but that's, uh, anyway, it's just, that's just wishful thinking. <laughs> but, but as long as I eat it, and I like egg, so I put lots of egg in it. Just taste the seasoning, actually. Did I put enough seasoning? If they want it more salty, they can just add, add soy sauce. I think that's going to be good. Do 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 do
Do do do do do do. There we go. I might have to change lens. Get a new. I might get a new lens again for uh for YouTube. Do do do. I might try a prime lens, but that'll be like super focused on my face and the background will be blurry. Anyway, I'll just keep experimenting, see how we go. Oh, so Nate Smith, are you mayhem? Is that what you're saying yes to? So have you got like two accounts on WhatsApp, sorry, on TikTok and now I'm confused. <laughs> I get to see. Have you got actually two accounts on TikTok? Because it's like, I can see two images there. Are you Nate Smith? Uh, <laughs> Because you said yes on YouTube. <laughs> Russell at nine and nine. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay. Nate, you're like number one fan, fan right now. I hope I'm not boring. <laughs> I hope I'm not too boring, huh? <laughs> you're watching me in three, what? You got three views. YouTube and two on TikTok. So, hopefully... I've inspired you if you want to make some fried rice. You don't... Or maybe you know a better way, but... so This is how I do my lazy way for um, for the fam. And I even used to do it this way um, at one of the cafes I was at. We just had like a bain marie. And um, people used to like it. I also used to put uh, the bean shoots in there. But the family doesn't like the bean shoots here, so... <laughs> Because the bean shoots just give it a bit of... They go soggy after a while, but it gives it a bit of height. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. i get you, Nate. Okay, starting to crisp up. Not too bad now. Almost there. Just a little bit more. This rice is kind of, it's kind of a little bit sticky, which is nice. So I can probably cook it out a little bit more because it's going to retain the moisture, yeah? Hmm, yummy. Yummy. But I don't want to be here all day, so that'll do. Okay, let's chuck my egg in. Do, 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 do. Lots of egg. There we go. I'm a chef, but I can't eat seafood anymore. Yeah, I don't think that's a loss. Not being able to eat seafood. Unless you really liked it. But, um, I know a lot of people that don't like seafood. To be honest, I don't cook a lot of seafood. I'd like to cook a lot more, though. Because, um, it's kind of like a totally different you know it can I think we're doing octopus at, octopus at work but um you can survive without seafood easy <laughs> why is that you say anymore you used to eat it there we go I reckon that's pretty good Chuck in a little bit of green stuff. So if you're a chef, Mayhem, far out. <laughs> Hope I haven't scandalized you with my... <laughs> How many years you been a chef for? Long time? There we go, a little bit of green stuff. Batch number one. Oh, that flame is really hot. There we go, folks. Is that gonna focus on the camera? 
Come on YouTube, just focus on there. There we go. Batch number one. Lovely. What's going on Val? How was your, how was your customer? Were they, was it a pleasant customer? <laughs> All I got was I'm. There's the dog barking. I'm watching you to tell friends about you. Thanks, Nate. I can't even smell... Can't even smell the seafood. I know someone that can't... They can't smell, um... They lost their sense of smell, but they used to be able to smell, so... When I was at their house one day, something was burning and they couldn't... They didn't smell it. <laughs> But they still cook really nicely because they didn't always. 20 years, long time, yeah? I'm just a baby chef. Only 15 years. Ah, I'm back. <laughs> Was it a pleasant transaction, Belle? How's, uh, how many, how many pickups have you had so far? Have a, sh have a shower and you don't s Ha ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the dad jokes coming. <laughs> ah. Hello, Rod Fowler. What's going on? Do do. Oi, what's going on? Do, 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 do. Three pickups, lots to go, and deliveries tomorrow. <coughs> Are you delivering as well, Val? Sorry about the noise. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Fully fledged uh, operation there, Val. <laughs> Would have been so much faster if my four big molds arrived. I had to make. Oh my goodness! Oh! Oh! By the way, what are the bombs, Val? Are they like uh, chocolate? Far out. How many times is that did you have to make it? 270 divided by 3, what's that? Um, is that like 70? You have to do it like 70 times? Okay. My math is 27 divided by 3. I can't do the math right now. 24 is 6, 27 is 7. 24 has 4 6s. 27 is 7. So yeah, I think that's 70 times the Nobel. That's crazy. Far out. <laughs> that must feel terrible knowing that you had some molds that should have been there. Hello Tom and Jerry, what's going on? So what are the so what are the is it like is a bomb like a chocolate? With uh, with a filling inside, or do 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 do. do, 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 do. Just a little taste there, shall we? Yeah, I think I got the seasoning good. Just tasted the batch I just cooked. Tastes good to me. Do, 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 do. 
Do, 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 do. So here we go, it's super, super lazy, super casual. Don't have to do any more work now, I just let it cook. Hello. Hello FML, how are ya? Oh. Do, 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 do. I, uh, when I started, I was in a kitchen and the chef who was cooking walked away to get something out of the cool room. I stopped the food burning steak and veggies. Was the chef happy that so you saved the food uh, mayhem? Was the chef happy? <laughs> yes, they are hot chocolate powder and marshmallows in chocolate. Uh, okay. Sorry, another pickup. Yeah. So that's pretty um far out, and you have to do that seventy times. It's pretty impressive, Val. All right. To be honest, that sucks a little bit. <laughs> Chuck in the egg. Have you made Have you made them all now, Val? All two hundred and seventy. But you know what will happen next year, Val. If you've got your big molds, you're going to allow yourself to um, to take more than 270 orders, so you'll be just as busy, I bet. <laughs> Was the chef happy, Nate? <laughs> it did suck, because each one needs... Yeah, I, I get you, Val. Like, if it's got... It was it? My mum used to make chocolates, and if it's got a filling in it, and you just said double coated, so that's what triple triple the work. Hello, Kayla. Far out. There we go. Getting a little bit crispy this one. Thing is you can make them in advance. Yeah, good point. So have you been like making them Val since like the beginning? But it was worth it because kids for new toys at Center Care for Xmas 21 new toy. That's good Val. That's pretty heroic what you're doing, I think. Super generous. God bless ya. Yes, he put me. Yeah, so that's how you became a cook mayhem. <laughs> See, that's what happens. <laughs> did you, did you, did... All right. Were you happy that you were a cook? Are you still, are you still working as a chef mayhem? Okay, batch number two, she's good. Or, I mean, as a chef. Okay, batch number two. There we go, folks. It's looking not too bad, huh? I think I've got six batches to go. So you're glad you've been a chef? Are you still working as a chef? Far out. Now I feel sorry for you. <laughs> oh, it was stupid. I have four... I, I have people four flavors and six designs to mix and match. Each time, next time each design, next time each design will be... Ah, uh, okay. Oh, far out, I see what you're saying, Val. Yeah, good point. <laughs> oh my goodness. I... I gave Sissy... <laughs> typos. <laughs> oh, far out. How is it on... You're on a yacht.
I saw um not your video I saw is it? I saw so you does your stove top tilt? So when the yacht tilts the stove stays level. I gave sorry. Hello Shane Lawson. Yeah, I saw a video on uh on TikTok where cooking on a yacht and the uh it the oven tilts so that the uh so that stays level. Do -do -do -do. So there's a couple of videos. It does far out. <laughs> That's crazy man. <laughs> Well, I mean, for me, it sounds crazy because I don't think I don't know if I'd want to cook cook at sea. What's the? Uh, you send me a message on Instagram, Val. I'll read it later. Vasu at nine. I'm just checking out your channel, Mayhem. Do, 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 do. You need to post some videos, Mayhem, of the uh, of like that oven tilt, the the stove top tilting and the oven tilting. Oh, that's if you want, but I reckon people would enjoy that on TikTok. Do 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 do. Hello, Mally181. Just cooking the fried rice here, folks. Delicious. Uh, we're almost half, yeah, not quite halfway. Hello, E7 E77SD. Oh, I've got a stretch now. Sorry guys, I'm just going to stretch. Oh, there we go. Body's, excuse me. Body's a little bit sore. I'm not used to working so hard because I've been... Because oh, I'm back at work. Hopefully, it'll get a little bit easier once I get broken in. I feel like sitting down, I'm so lazy. <laughs> I might sit down. I'm not used to being back at work. Hello user 8426 1036 3879. Hello. <laughs> Vasu at 99. Um, let me. Let me. I didn't even look at it, Val. Let me check it out. Okay, let's go. Let's see. My other phones are dead at the moment. Let's see if I'm logged on to Instagram on here. Uh, let's see if this works. Yes. Okay. I think. Um, no, I'm not logged on to Instagram here. Oh, do I like work? Um, not a hundred percent sure yet, Val. Uh, <laughs> yes and no. Like it's it's not the same. It's a little bit different from when I left. Because so, 
there's a bit more pressure on them now because during lockdown they started doing a lot of other like selling a lot of products and cakes and stuff um, which is a good thing but when you're already a super busy cafe because now they're getting busier again and the head chef has changed um, the old head chef's still there he's actually like the cousin of the owner he's, he's a pretty cool guy, he's young but the new head chef he's a super nice guy, he's from fine dining but so much pressure on him and uh I think he's still he's settling in to be as the head chef as well. So I'm finding it a little bit awkward. Like <laughs> I'll have a bit of a, a bit of a sooky rant if I if I mention something or I get in a pit, I, I annoy them. If I don't mention it, I annoy them. If I ask something, I annoy them. If I don't ask, I annoy them. So it's a it's. But it's, I think it's just because there's a lot of pressure on the uh, head chef. I mean, hopefully things will get a little bit easier, a little bit smoother. And obviously I haven't been at work for a while, so hopefully... Um, but I do move around a lot, Val, so I don't want to... Uh, I've had 25 full-time jobs in 10 years. What's going on, Wayne? We're cooking fried rice. Uh, that's true Val, there is a little bit because um, you know why though, I think we're actually a little bit similar uh, how, well, he's from fine dining right so he's worked for he worked for at one of Ramsey's restaurants and a couple of other big 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 chefs in, uh, in the UK he's from Northern Ireland so um, I've always worked um, I've always performed best in super casual places but you know that's that's all part of team building yeah like is there's it's part of the uh the amalgamation i've forgotten the there's i studied it i studied team building when i, I did outdoor recreation um Nah, not me, Josh. I never worked at any famous restaurants. Not me, but my my chef, my head, my current head chef. So he's like, <laughs> he spilled a little bit of food on himself the other day, and he's like, <laughs> for me at work, I've got food all over me because <laughs> it just splatters everywhere. I mean, <laughs> so it's totally different. But um, it's part of team building. Is um, when you've got a new team, because obviously they've hired a lot of new chefs as well. Everyone has to like, uh, there's always going to be clashes and if everything moves forward in a positive way, people are going to start making compromises for the sake of the team and then they're going to become super, super efficient and productive. So um, that's how it should work out. So it's all part of it, but um, obviously teething, teething issues right now, Val. Teething, teething, teething problems. There we go, there's batch number three. High quality. And... I love going to good restaurants. Just don't like the pricing, so just go to the low. <laughs> Rocky, what's going on? High quality and okay. You mean the food, Rocky? Or if you want high quality video, go to YouTube. I'm on YouTube right now, guys. Uh, you can click the link. Uh, the link is in my bio. You can get a better view of what's happening. But the high quality, yeah, I mean, he's, he's up the end. The food is a bit better than what it was um, when six months ago. So I've got, you know, it's, it is what it is. I've only been back at work for a couple of weeks. So like, I've got like a, a really bad burn, which always happens when I'm, starting out afresh at work I'm always cutting and burning myself because more than usual it's just another day in the office but because of the nerves and getting you know getting used to everyone and everything deep karma hello oh there we go sizzle 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 batch number four do, 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 do. I actually, to be, 
I actually don't like eating out that much. For me, um, I think it's because I work. It's because I work in the kitchen. For me, uh, Josh, I just love to get takeaway and sit on the street. That's that's for me. That's 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 fine dining. <laughs> One of my old bosses went to, I think it was Heston Blumenthal, the fat duck at Crown. This was a couple of, a few years ago now. And he said the meal went for like six hours or something. And he said he fell asleep after two hours, he fell asleep at the table. <laughs> he is the man who is the first time. Not sure what you're saying, Rocky. Do 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 I got a feeling, ooh, ooh. it's a lonesome away from my. Oh, uh, am I moves by choice or force? Oops, save me some boss. Okay, Wayne, I'll try and save you some fried rice. Um, yeah. Uh, so, no, I moved by choice, Val. That's uh, that's that's why I moved to Melbourne so that um. Chefs move around a lot in general anyway, but uh, I mean I always imagined that I would just, you know, work for a good chef and I would, I, I don't like it, but that's, that's how I'm playing the game. Why are you making it so much? Why am I making so much? Because I'm cooking for the family, um, so this is just two batches here and I've got more. Because uh, cooking for the family, um, cooking for the family, Josh. And I'm doing it in small batches so that I get it nice and crispy. Oh, Rocky's a troll. <laughs> oh, okay. He's not saying that much though. He is the man who is the first time. Do do do. Or radio was thinking. <laughs> Up to you, Val. But he's not saying much, so I'll leave it in your your trustworthy. <laughs> I've got the power. <laughs> I don't think so, Val. He's not saying anything bad yet. <laughs> Just keep an eye on it. I'm cooking it all for you, for, for you guys as well, Josh, if you want to come over for dinner. <laughs> Jokes. <laughs> Oi, there goes a little bit on the floor. There we go. Easy peasy. No, I won't. There we go. The wisdom of Val. <laughs> Hello, Black3066. What's going on? Back again. Hello, Az Azair. Welcome. This is the fried rice, folks. This is the moment you've all been waiting for. Might be too far to go for dinner. Where, where are you at, Josh? I'm in Melbourne, so yeah, I guess... <laughs> I'm guessing, where are you at? Queensland? Hello, Craig. Craig D, what's going on? Boy. Nice and crispy. Four hours, far out. Wodonga, right on the border. 
Yeah, a little bit far. You, it's quite a few good restaurants in Wodonga anyway. I like the uh, the Indian restaurant. Is it? It's pretty nice that one. I think the fight, the Indian one. They, I just got some takeaway there, but I saw some of the dishes they were serving. Look, they looked amazing. It was really busy too. I think it's. Is it on the Wodonga side or the Aubrey side? I can't remember. I think it's one of the top rated restaurants on TripAdvisor. That was why I went. Because I was just passing through. Hello Summer Dreams, welcome back. Take on me I'll be gone Take on me, shining away. Do -do -do -do. Boat, helicopter, and plane. <laughs> so you reckon it might take a little bit. Oh, I see. that's what you would need to take to get here, um, Mayhem. I get you. These one is both pounds, but Wodonga one is better. Ah, okay. Yeah, I can't remember which one I went to. Oi, sorry. But it was one of the top rated ones on TripAdvisor, because um, that was why I went. And it was, it was good. Good enough. Um, Okay, this is batch number four, I believe. Let me turn that plane down. There we go, folks. Batch number... It's looking at not too bad, folks. Got to get it nice and crispy. Family likes it crispy. Fa the family is Filipino, so they know what... They know what rice... They know what good rice is and what bad rice is. So <laughs> I've got to make it crispy and lots of egg, and they'll be happy. Hello, Adam. Sis, hello, Jamie. Take on me. I'll be... Hello, April. Topfer. What's going on? I'll be gone. Take on me. Shining away. Do, do, do. By the way, how's the audio on YouTube? I never, um, I guess it must be okay because you guys would have said something, eh? It's probably not there anymore. Restaurants coming. Oh, wow. Okay. My other phone is flat, so I can't even look it up to find out which one I went to. Another good Indian restaurant in Bendigo. I think that was like the number one restaurant in Bendigo. That was really good. I went there like, I was doing some casual work up that way as, for the agency as a chef. And I, I think I went there like five times. Do hello, follow you, g'day on the SoundCloud. What's going on? Thanks Mayhem. <laughs> It's a bit late in the day to be saying that, but for me to be asking if the audio is okay, but that's good. Are you sick, Rocky? What's going on? <laughs> Ed Buns. What's happening? Ed Buns, are you Texas? I've forgotten where you're from. Ed Buns, where you living? Fried rice. Fried rice. Rocky's sick. What do you got? You got COVID, Rocky. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't laugh. I hope you get better soon. Did you cook? Ah, uh, yes. Rice is cooked. I just cooked it in the rice cooker, yeah? This is... Mixed is back. I'm still live streaming, Nico. And what about... Oh, you have, you've already seen how I did the rice. Ed Buns, where are you at?
Thanks for the likes and for uh, mayhem. Thank you for the likes. Yes, I am Dallas. Okay. Have have you been um? I've been following all the all the news on the election. To be honest, better make it right. Use Uncle Roger. <laughs> we'll be so disappointed and re yeah. I know I should I should I should tag Uncle Roger. See what he thinks, shouldn't I? I'm live streaming on YouTube. Have you been concerned about all the um, stuff going on with the election there? Yeah, there we go. But um. It made me really respect Texas because, excuse me, what's, what's happening? People are moving out of California and going to Texas. I think Elon Musk moved there, yeah? And um, Joe Rogan moved to Texas. Who else? Because they were sick of all the craziness going on in California. So, rock and rock. Good old Texas, mate. Oh. No, avoid it. <laughs> But, um, okay, wise move at bunts, avoid politics. <laughs> okay. Hello, yellow fins. What's going on, Miko? Are you working? Oh, that's because the Dems are proposing. Yeah. And then Texas was trying to sue the other states and the Supreme Court didn't even want to look at it. Kind of weird what's all going on. I think the election is the last thing they're thinking about. COVID is flowing hard over there. Social and economical changes. Chaviana. Yeah, mate. What's... Cook, sorry. What? <laughs> Cook... Caviana, what do you mean cook? What's going on? Cook, it's a cook boy. <laughs> or cooking a fried rice, mate. <laughs> do, 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 do. Texas have lower cost of living and income state tax free. Sounds good. I think I want to, I think I want to visit Texas now. Hey, Montana Stevens. Hello. Welcome. Take on me. Batch number, I think this is batch number five. Almost done. Let's, let's taste it. A little bit hot. I think that's good. Okay, let's add the egg. Oh, I've still got a lot of egg left. So I'm going to put a heap of egg into this one. So I'm... So I've got to use up all the egg. Hello. Hello, love, Max Steele. Hello, Scotty. Joe Rogan said on his podcast, the reason he moved is because Texas are... is because Texas are a lot less. Plus the income here can be almost as high as California. Oh, okay. I thought he said that he moved because um, during all the riots, the um, they just let it happen in California. They did like nothing to stop it. So he was just like, or maybe it's, mo it's probably multiple reasons, of course. Oh, hi. What's going on, Scotty? Scotty D. Oh, taxes. Oh, what? Joe Rogan... Because taxes... Oh, sorry. Taxes. Now I get you. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh -huh, yeah, because he's got that, what, that... That hundred million dollar deal with Spotify. So maybe... <laughs> I get you. So he's probably saving a lot of money. <laughs> by going to Texas. I get you. Do, 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 do. 
There we go. Okay, tuck in some green stuff. There we go. Make it look pretty. Did you get the t-shirt? Oh, hang on. Scotty, is this the OG Scotty? Yeah, because you started it and then the girls, Sarah kept co and, and Val and the other, a couple other girls, they liked it. It's Cook Boy. I've got my own merch, Scotty. I opened a store. Cook Boy. Cook Boy merch. All because of you. <laughs> Okay, this is batch, batch number five. Which is faster, hot or cold? What do you mean? Green, yeah, green stuff. That's what it is, green stuff. It was just, it's actually a bit of spinach, but you don't normally put spinach in um, fried rice. But it just gives it a bit of colour, yeah? Yeah, this Scotty's laughing. Which is, yeah, I don't know what you mean by faster, hot or cold, but um, yeah, Scotty, look what you've done to me. I've opened up um, a merch store, mate. So far I've sold a couple of stickers. I'm happy about that. What else have I got? I've got this headband. This is so expensive. I'll get a much cheaper one in coming in. <coughs> I've even made characters, Scotty. Let me show, what is it? Let me, let me show you that. <laughs> Scotty, look what's going on. I've made this. This is, um, how do I show this to you without burning the t-shirt? Depends on the fried rice. Some chow. Oh, you mean the rice. Some finely sliced spinach. Can you, can you see that? That's grill girl, mate. I've even made, and I'm, I've got like another five other characters. I'm, I'm, I haven't done much sketching recently, but yeah. If, yeah, as far as I remember, you're the one that was calling me cook boy, yes, yeah, Scotty, at the very beginning. Is that right? <laughs> you don't come on, you haven't been on much in the last few months, but... Yeah, I'm pretty sh <laughs> Crazy, huh? <laughs> Hello, Kate. Kate Easton. Okay, two more batches to go. So, in total, eight, eight batches of fried rice. Get it nice and crispy. Kind of crazy, eh, Scotty? Yeah, I bet I, I should give you a follow. Um, how do I? Because it's all it's all your fault, Scotty. If, if if you're the one, as far as I remember, you're the one that called me um cook boy, nah? It's been a long time ago. Jim Lecure. Hello. Oh, there goes my tongue. Oh, you, so you mean which is faster, hot or cold rice? Is that what you meant? I've got to get another pair of tongs in there. Just drop those ones on the floor. Okay, you're gonna cook. Um, nah, no dessert today, Josh. It'll take me an hour to clean up, and I've got to get up early tomorrow. Yeah, and if you boil a funny bone, you can make make it great. There we go. Yes, now I, that's you, Scotty, Mr. Jokes. <laughs> Now I remember, I'm 100% sure it's you now, yeah? <laughs> You're not cooking the fried rice from scratch. Air buns. Here's, no, I mixed, see what I did is I put in everything in here. I put in the rice, cooked meats. I had some ham and some cooked chicken, which I cooked off. I put in the julienne carrot, julienne onion, garlic, the seasoning, and a little bit of oil. And now I'm frying, I mixed it all together. And now I'm frying it off in, uh, in small batches. To get it nice and crispy, yeah? And I add the egg, uh, and egg and the green stuff now. Hour to clean, you're gonna use a toothbrush. No, it's because, um, Josh, I've got like my laptop, computer monitor, two cameras, a microphone, 
I've, I'm live streaming on YouTube as well. So I've got all this, not only have I got all my dishes and my tech gear, I've got all my computer technology to clean up. Teddy bears don't order desserts as they are always just... <laughs> That's Scotty alright, I remember you now. <laughs> Mr. Dad Jokes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, far out. <laughs> there we go. We missed the entertainment. <laughs> oh, yeah. I just leave it there. No, but I probably won't live stream for another week, uh, Josh. And also, because of the way the kitchen's set up, and I don't want to, you know, my housemates have got Olivia too, so. I've got to, yeah, I just, I just want to clean it all down so it's not in the way. If, if I had, uh, how do I say it? So right here where the cameras are is a wall. Cook boy. So, um, all my camera gear is along right in the, near the sink and the, and above the stove, like. If I had a, if it was like a bench kitchen and there was like maybe a living room behind it, I could just have all my camera gear on tripods and it wouldn't be in the way of, of the actual kitchen, but it's kind of like right in the way. So. <laughs> Cook boy. <woo. laughs> okay. Let's, I'm going to add a lot of egg to this one because I've still got heaps of egg left over. There we go. Oh yeah, you can catch a cold. I don't get that one though, Scotty, to catch a cold. Yeah, I know, Josh. Maybe I should show you what it looks like. It's super sketchy. <laughs> but you know, it's better to do it. I've been live streaming on and off. Well, not now that I'm back at work, not so much, but... Uh, I think, how many live streams have I done? Maybe... I'd have to look it up on YouTube, but... Um, it's, I think it's better to do it not properly than, um, how do you say, to do it imperfectly than not do it at all. So I think, I think a couple of people have appreciated my live streams. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> but yeah, it's pretty sketchy, pretty sketchy setup. <laughs> I guess I could show you, it's such a mess. Just let me finish this batch and I'll show you how sketchy it is. Hello, Greek boy. What's going on? Yeah, so by the way, I'm live on YouTube. If you wanna, the link is in my bio. So if you wanna see what it looks like on YouTube, just uh, check it out. There we go. That looks good to me. Chuck in some green stuff. One more batch to go. There we go. There we go. Batch number, I think it's batch number six or seven. Oh, one more batch to go. Let's get some Coke. Had to chop down some trees as they were sketchy. They were a bit shad. Is it? Is it? They were. Oh, see, I can't see the why on my. On my they were a bit shady. I get ya. Ha ha! That's a funny one, Scotty. <laughs> Okay, last batch, let's go, let's go. Almost done, folks. This is the grand finale, everyone. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. How does, how does it go? Ladies and gentlemen, now for the main of <laughs> Cook Boy. You call me cook boy, it's all your fault mate. You gotta take take responsibility for it. 
Okay, let me show you. This is I'm probably gonna regret picking up my phone because it's gonna mess up my system, but let me show you my shady setup. Um, how do I flip the camera? There we go. Okay, so see I have a microphone. See this that's what I see up up here I have my other tablet so I can read the comments easier. I got my microphone, camera, camera. Take 10%. Oh, there we go. This is camera here. That's my computer monitor. So that's what you see on YouTube. Full HD split screen. You see in the walk, and that's me. I've got my little table set up here with all my ingredients. There's all my cables. Right? This is my messy sink. See, look at that mess. It's all. See, I've got. I want the live stream to keep flowing, so I just chuck it all there, and then I clean it all off at the end. I've got my lights, a couple of fluorescent lights, I've got my computer, there's all my cables, and see I've even got another camera for taking a picture of the, uh, the thumbnail for YouTube. Just let me flip this. See all my power cords, and they're messy, messy as my power cords are just running along here. So that's it. With that much equipment I expect the best. <laughs> You're yeah, so funny, I know. Pretty dodgy, eh? Pretty dodgy, eh? <laughs> Get up, check it out on YouTube, Scotty. You'll see the good quality there, huh? I've made some pretty good video edits there along the way. <laughs> it's Michelle, how are you? So, yeah, that's what's happening, Josh. <laughs> Is it worth it? I don't know yet. We'll see how we go. But um, no, it's been worth it. Like I've got, a, I've had a, quite a few regulars. Who have I had? I've got. Let's see how many I can name. Val, Narissa, Bubbles, Sarah. Haven't seen her for a little while though. She's probably busy. She, she, um. Janice, I haven't seen her for a long time. She always kind of came and went though. Uh, Miko, but I know Miko, he's always coming on and off. That's my chef mate. But he's just on TikTok, he doesn't really look on YouTube. Mrs. Uh, I think it's Mrs. Filipino lady for uh, Mrs. Mrs. P, is it? Mrs. Mrs. D. Um, who else? Uh, Neri. So I've got about 10, I've had about 10, I've forgotten a few of the other names. If it doesn't fall, you good. There we go, that's right Josh. <laughs> yeah. the, that equipment would have cost, yeah, no wonder you were, oops, that's, that's right Scotty. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of money there. Um, that laptop, because, yeah, actually that's a lot. Uh, <laughs> that's a lot of money there Scotty. <laughs> I don't care to say how much. <laughs> Just figuring it out. That's seven, eight. Yeah, there's a lot of lot of money there. <laughs> Do you, all right. There's heaps of egg in this one. That's the last batch. It's basically scrambled eggs with a bit of rice in it. But I don't think the house. I think they like one of the housemates. I think he's gonna like it. Melbourne Tupperware. Hello. Welcome. Do, 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 do. And that's it folks, almost done. So much egg in this batch. <laughs> the last batch, you know two minute new, yeah I know. I don't like them though Scotty. Oh, not very much anyway. If I was gonna do the two minute noodles, I would wanna like do a, pro like a proper noodle stir fry. And I'd just use two minute noodles. I don't really like them by themselves. I used to eat them a lot when I was camping as a, as a kid, but I got sick of them. It's kind of like, yeah, anyway. Okay, chuck in some green stuff. There we go, finished. I remember when I went and got a new computer, nearly had a heart attack when I, yeah. Oh, shivers. 
And that's a top end laptop then, um, Josh, for, for live streaming. That is 10th generation um, i7 um, RTX 270 Super, um, one terabyte SSD and a two terabyte SSD, 32 uh, gigabyte of RAM, 240 FPS frame rate for the screen. I don't need that, but that's because it's a gamer's laptop. So yeah, uh, that's from Aftershock. So that's a, yeah, that's super, really specced out. Why did the Warriors go to the Tupperware party? Because he was after a uh, tight seal. <laughs> <coughs> Scotty, uh, this is a G-rated channel. Any more of that and um, you'll be banned. There we go. I think if that's what you meant. Okay. Yeah, I got... Yeah, same Josh. That's how much... Same. That's, that's how much... That's a lot, isn't it? Okay, here's... This is it, folks. This is... Eight batches of fried rice. Oh, oh. <laughs> there we go. This is the really eggy part. So, Kuya, big brother likes this part, all the egg. Tupperware seals well. Yeah, I know what you mean, but it sounds like a little bit, a little like a little bit of an innuendo there. I wasn't. This is a G G rated channel, Scotty. <laughs> Damber, how are ya? Okay, people. Um, should I do a taste test? I'll just do a taste test, see how it tastes. And then that's it, folks. I've got to go. I've got to clean up my kitchen and then start thinking about work tomorrow. For <laughs> four months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see what you mean. <laughs> it's hilarious. G, got it. Thanks, Scotty. <laughs> Tastes pretty good to me. Not, not nothing special, but is it just a good, good old fried rice? Texture's not, you know, it's not like, it's not like Chinese restaurant standard, but it's better than some though. Some of them aren't that good, but it's not as good as the good ones. But it's good, good enough for the family, and I hope they gobble that all up. They normally, normally, yeah, it normally goes pretty fast. Because live with Filipino and, the, and, and, a, and a Spaniard and they like rice. So guys, thank you so much for watching. My battery's low as well. God bless you all. Um, become a cook boy and you can upgrade to rice. There we go. God bless you all. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for being patient. Thanks for um, the chat. Thanks for giving me company. If you want to re-watch the live stream, go over to YouTube. If you subscribe to my YouTube, that would be great because... Um, um, I went to all that effort to set up the cameras. <laughs> see ya, see ya mayhem. See ya Josh. See ya Scotty. And yeah, and thanks for all the cook all the cook boy ideas, Scotty. It it's not really taken off yet, but uh it's a it's the long term game, yeah. Thanks Josh. This is um this is my this is my cook boy artwork. See that's little cook boy. He's, um, you can't see it very well on TikTok, but there's all these chef buddies and he's looking off into the distance, Scotty. Anyway, okay. Ciao, 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 guys. Next time. <laughs> okay, TikTok is off. Thank you so much, YouTube. YouTube. Um, if you're still there, Nate, Mayhem, thanks for the watching me. Um, it's good to get a couple of views on YouTube, considering I go to all the effort to set up my cameras. <laughs> okay, God bless. Um, I better head off, clean up, clean up the kitchen. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Godspeed. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do